Are you struggling with the width of your table in a shiny flex dashboard? You're not alone. Many users face this issue, and today we're going to show you how to extend the render table width to make your data presentation clearer and more effective. I totally get it. It can be really frustrating when your tables don't display the way you want them to. You want your data to be readable and visually appealing, but sometimes the default settings just don't cut it. You're definitely in the right place to find a solution. Here's the specific question we're addressing today. One user asked, how can I extend the column width of my render table in Shiny Flex dashboard? This is a common concern, especially when dealing with larger data sets or longer text entries. Let's dive in to how we can tackle this issue. So why does this happen? By default, Shiny Flex dashboard sets a standard width for tables, which can sometimes be too narrow for your content. This can lead to text being cut off or difficult to read. Understanding this limitation is the first step in finding a solution. And stick around. At the end of this video, I'll share a bonus tip that will help you customize your tables even further, making your dashboards not just functional, but also visually stunning. To extend the column width in the render table function, the user should modify the width parameter. Instead of using 100%, they can specify a larger value, such as 150%. Next, the user can also adjust the CSS styles to further customize the table's appearance. This can be done by adding a custom CSS file to the dashboard. In the custom CSS file, the user can define specific styles for the table. For example, they can set a minimum width for the table columns. Finally, the user should save the changes and refresh the dashboard to see the updated table width and styles in action. Fun fact, did you know that the first spreadsheets were created in the late 1970s? They were a far cry from the interactive dashboards we use today, but they laid the groundwork for data visualization as we know it. Now let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative solution provided by another user suggests adjusting the width of the main panel. They recommend setting the width to 12 and enclosing the table within a div element. This method effectively extends the table's width. This approach allows for better control over the table's appearance, ensuring it fits well within the dashboard layout. That's all on that answer. Let's take a look at another one. An alternative approach suggests that using main panel may not be the best fit for your table. Instead, consider using sidebar layout, which allows for better organization. This user also recommends switching to DT render data table for more flexibility, as it automatically takes up the full width of the browser window. Additionally, consider using fill page and fluid page in your flex dashboard to control the size of individual elements more effectively. Here's that bonus tip I promised. Consider using CSS to further customize your table's appearance. With a few simple styles, you can enhance not just the width, but also the overall look of your tables. And there you have it. You've successfully extended the column width of your render table in Shiny Flex Dashboard. Remember, a well-presented table can make all the difference in how your data is perceived. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe for more tips and tricks.